In this video, you will learn what contactless payments are and how they work. What are contactless payments? Well, quite simply, a contactless payment is when you wave your smartphone or credit card at the top of the credit card terminal in a store and payment is made instantly. There's no need to dip your chip or swipe your stripe. You've likely heard of this before. You may know it as Apple Pay, Samsung Pay, or Google Pay. All of these are contactless ways to pay. When you pull out your phone and wave it like a magic wand for payment, that is contactless payment. Hey, Charging fans, we have assembled the top 10 ways that we think you can improve your payments today. To get this valuable resource, just go in the description of this video and click the link. Many cards also have the ability to be used in this contactless manner. Newer credit cards with this symbol on them, it kind of looks like a Sidewise Wi-Fi logo, can tap and go. This tech, it goes by a number of different names. You can call it tap and go, tap to pay, NFC, contactless, touchless, and even mobile payments. These new cards are rolling out in the United States slowly, but they're already really popular in many other countries. We're gonna talk more about that in other videos on this channel. You should subscribe to our channel right now to ensure that you see those videos. So now that we know what contactless payments are, how do contactless payments work? Well, in technical terms, contactless payments use a technology called near field communication, or NFC as it's commonly called. And NFC, it's based on radio frequency identification, or RFID. So when you pull out your phone or a card to tap a payment, it works just like you might use a key card to access your office building. Uh, you know, uh, back when, we used to go to offices. A tech like this has been around since the 80s, but it's only been the last five years that pretty much all smartphones contain NFC antennas. Now, devices with NFC chips like your phone or newer cards, they must come within four centimeters, or for us Americans, 1.6 inches, of the other device in order to communicate. A physical touch, it's not actually required, and I recommend not touching the terminal with your card or your phone. That's how the cool kids do it. That is what contactless is and how it works. You want to know more about contactless? Awesome. Subscribe to this channel. We have more videos coming that are gonna tell you all about it. And for now, I want you to check out this video. Remember at Chargent, we are always here to help.